Anybody who knows me knows that the most difficult thing for me to do is to write. And that's because I absolutely hate writing. But for our two year anniversary, I wrote my wife a letter uh, that I'm going to be reading for you. In the two year span, I've taken a bunch of photos of my wife. I find her to be the greatest model because every time we do a shoot, something inwardly and outwardly would change. And which got me thinking so I asked her to do a different type of photo shoot with me this time. I didn't tell her what it was going to be for, but just so that I could capture her. Because in two years, there's some things that I've noticed about you. And I wanted to let you know what I've noticed. When I first met you, I was attracted to you because you're cute. Little did I know how much depth was behind that beautiful exterior. When I first met you, I loved to stare at your eyes because they always sparkle. Now that I look into your eyes, I stare because they sparkle for me. I love your eyes because they genuinely show how much you love me. I love your eyes because they tell the truth before you even say a word. When I first met you, I liked you for your smile. Or maybe I just liked the lips that came with the smile. And how bad I wanted to kiss those lips. Now when I see that smile, I love it because it's probably coming from an awful joke I told you. Or a memory that we're reminiscing on. Like how nervous I was when you kissed me for the first time. And I mean, I was horrible. But I was cute, so you let it slide. Or maybe that smile just comes from a good morning. Whether that smile comes from laughter, comes from joy, or from love, when that smile greets me at the door, I melt. When I first met you, I liked your hair, just because it was on your head. I liked your hair because I think it represented the idea of a woman that I thought I'd like. But I love your hair now because of what I know about the woman it sits on. I love your hair because it switches up all the time. But I have to be honest, I really hate the maintenance. But I'm pretty sure you hate it too. I love your hair because it marks the journey that you've been on. And whenever you decide to change it, it is not to define your beauty, but to express creativity. And to me, that's the most inspiring expression of self. When I first met you, I thought you were so regal. And I thought you were so unattainable to me. And that attracted me the most. I think that attracts most people to be able to get something they can't have. But the thing I feared most was that if you got to know me, that you would realize that I am nothing like you. That I'm not worthy. Only problem is now that I got to know you, I see that we are very much alike. Even though I'm the nerdy one, you're just as goofy. And that makes every moment so hilarious. And just when I think you couldn't get any weirder, it's like you just wake up and like, you know what, you haven't seen nothing yet. That goofy and weird nature shows in me how tangible you are and how close we actually are to one another. And every time I learn something new, I fall more and more in love with you. When I first met you, I loved that body for mere external reasons. Now, I love that body because, as my shirt usually says, my wife is hot. Need I say more? But I will say more. My wife is objectively hot. Not subjectively. Objectively hot. But you're even hotter now just because you're mine. To be honest with you, I don't look at you the same way. My heart doesn't flutter like it used to. But my love for you has grown exponentially because you're mine. I can claim you. Now you're a treasure. Now you're a part of me. When I show you love, it's like showing love to myself. There's a reason why you're my perfect model because you're both beautiful inside and out. 
when I first met you, I thought your tattoos made you look so hard, like so rugged, like a person who took risks. Now <laughs> I see your tattoos. I see, I see stories. I see memories. I see moments that you regret. I see more and more reasons to love you. When I first met you, I liked you because of how much you knew God. But now that I know you, I love you because I see God in your eyes. Your smile, your hair, your personality, that body in you. My pictures cannot capture just how beautiful you are, but I promise to continue to capture your story, our journey. And when we grow old, I will go back to the pictures. I'll go back to this moment. Now I add reasons why I love you. I'm coming back home to you. I'm coming back home. I'm coming back home to you. I'm coming back home. I'm coming back home to you. I'm coming back home. I'm coming back home. But I'm blessed to be stuck with you